Hey friends, thanks for stopping in to watch my video. My name is Sarah, if you're new here, and I am a mom to twins, and I also live with a handful of chronic illnesses, but today's video, we are going to try a new recipe, and I'm super excited. It is called like queso chicken, chicken con queso, I don't know, something like that, but it is something I've been wanting to try, super simple. Toss it in the crock pot or instapot, which I'm going to use today, and kind of toss it in. And it's just dump and go, and you can eat it a few different ways. I am going to do mine, I think, on little tiny street taco flour tortillas because they were on sale. So that's what I have on hand. So I thought I'd bring you along with me and see how it turns out. For dinner tonight, I am going to try a new recipe called queso chicken i think it's called so you only need these ingredients well you do need either rotel or diced tomatoes and green chilies but i don't have those all i have is diced tomatoes so it'll be fine it'll be a little less spicy because the queso it has spice in it too so what you do is you put chicken breast in the instapot first cover it with some taco seasoning it said to use like one packet then in a bowl you're going to mix together your tomato products, your chilies, and your chicken broth, and pour that on top. And then you're gonna cook it, and then when it's done for the cook time, then you're gonna add in just some of the salsa, or queso, and then you, you with the rest of the queso, you just pour it on top of like your taco or your rice when it's done. So that's why I'm gonna try a new recipe for dinner time. We'll see how it goes. All right, it is done cooking. Now the recipe says to drain up so drain out some of the excess liquid we have in here and then i am going to use a hand mixer to shred up the chicken and then we are going to go ahead and put some of this queso in here and then mix that in and then you just put the top back on and let it on, keep warm for a little bit to heat up the cheese sauce all right here is our chicken all shredded up and i did add about half of Let's see. Yeah, about half a jar of queso. I just got this from Walmart. Half a jar of queso. And then with the rest of the queso, you can put it on top of your taco after you've set it all up. Looks pretty good and it smells divine. All right, here is the finished product. So I am serving these on these little teeny tiny street tacos. There was a coupon, so they were like under a dollar for two bags each. And then on mine... I'm putting some fake cheese and I had some romaine lettuce so I just kind of shredded that up and put it on mine and the kids will make up their own and however many they want I'm gonna eat two tiny ones and see how that goes so that is how the new recipe turned out and let me tell you it is delicious the chicken is very juicy and very flavorful now you're supposed to put additional queso on top but I don't I'm try not to eat very much cheese so I'm gonna skip that but I did mix queso into the chicken itself so about half of a jar 